Badger Loop is a student organization here at UW-Madison. Um, some might, might say that we're an engineering build team, and what we do is we build Hyperloop pods and we compete in the SpaceX Hyperloop pod competition. Uh, recently we've been kind of framing ourselves as a STEM education group where we um, use building Hyperloop pods as a way to help um, people take the things they learn in the classroom and apply it uh, to something a bit greater. So, um, both for not just like engineering students, but people from all over campus. Since last competition, we've been just preparing for the next competition. You know, a lot of work goes into just making sure we have a viable product. You know, we're always kind of in the prototyping phase and we're always building off our designs, especially from year to year. And that's actually something we're incorporating into our org this year. We want to make sure we're always improving on our past designs. So really, I think we want to just be taken seriously and seen as high quality engineers making a great product. The goal for this competition, see, you could look at it a couple different ways. From kind of like the high level view, it's to like try and develop this new exciting idea in transportation and try and make people's lives better by bringing something to the table that like the current technology can't offer. The goal kind of for a lot of the people on the team is to become uh, better engineers and to learn a lot along the way uh, through the different like hiccups and various problems that, that we face along the way. Um, so for us, it's really to grow as engineers as, and as people. I think it's easy to lose focus because the scope is so big. As you're designing and as you're building, you don't really see like what it's gonna be. And same goes for operations too. Like, you know, we're putting all this work into something that doesn't necessarily physically exist yet. You get like so invested in it and it's something that's so important to like all of us that like the stakes get really high when, uh, when the potential for failure is, is always so close. But that's something that always keeps you super motivated along the entire way. We all have a lot going on already. Um, we're just trying to struggle along being college students anyway. And then you throw this massive time commitment on top of it. It's just so easy for this to just be like all encompassing in your life. I think of what makes Badger Group special is that it's kind of this ragtag group of students. You know, people from not just engineering, but I think we have four different colleges that are represented on our team. So it's just like this very interesting group of people that come together and everybody's very passionate about the project. So it's kind of inspiring in that aspect. And then just the ability to like get things done. <laughs> There's a lot that we don't know, but I think it's incredible our ability to figure out things that we don't know. I know I speak for everyone on the executive team and everyone else on the team when I say that I think every person that is here at Reveal, obviously, and is, you know, going to the competition works really hard and puts in the time that's really necessary for us to do this and we really couldn't do it without everyone's effort. If in July it does all come together mm -hmm. and we make it into two, what would that mean? That would be incredible. I mean, it would be, um, you know, I've thought about it in my head. I try to keep it out of my head, but um, just like I get super excited and just like thinking about the possibility of that happening, um, seeing something that I've I've put two years into it, but you know, there's many members on the team who've joined as soon as they got here and have spent their whole college career working on Badger Loop, and you know, the the people I've met and all the time I put in, work I've put in. The, the stress that it's caused me, like all of that would be paid off times a hundred, you know, it would, um, it just like seeing something that we've all worked on, come together as a team and actually get to go and potentially over a hundred miles an hour, that would be um, unreal.
after all that we've been through. Yes, I do.